Okay, this is the first time I've made a video on YouTube, so I'll make this quick. Uh, this power button fix uh, applies to the Dell Inspiron 15 and Inspiron 17 models 5558, 5758, 3568, 3558, and I'm guessing it's the Dell Inspiron 15, 17, 5000 series uh, and or 3000 series laptop notebooks. Anyways, take a good look. There's a the power button. You'll see videos all over. Um, where people are taking this out. So I'm not even gonna show you that. I'm not even gonna show you the power button. I'm just gonna tell you how to fix it and, and why it happens. Uh, Cause that's the one thing they <laughs> really aren't showing you in the videos. In, in fact, they just take this out and they put it back in. And, and then I guess somehow the power button's just working. Other people are replacing the power button, which I don't think you have to do at all. Uh, Cause what you'll do is, you know, when you get the button out, of course, in the videos, they're pressing this and you can, you know, this is the, the power button I replaced and uh, you push on that and I can hear it, uh, feel it go down and, and uh, you know, you're basically just clicking the clicker. Um, and that's what it looks like, you know. Uh, yours might differ a little bit. It's a horrible, poor design. Uh, so how does, why does it happen? Well, um, the button over time, as you press the power button, uh, behind this power button, you see the videos of them taking a uh, screwdriver, flathead or something and, and pushing down. Uh, it's a bad joke, I guess. Um, I don't, who knows what they're doing um, I can only assume that uh, on the other side of this power button where you're pushing down is a plastic cross so let's talk about that because that's the problem that plastic cross uh, horrible design really a flawed design so what are they doing are they pushing the, the only thing I could think of them doing is taking a flathead and pushing that cross smashing it back up because what's happened is it's the hard plastic has really just been pressed down uh, so, you know, I used a uh, really heavy weld, hard weld, and just, you know, all you have to do is bring it up a hair, you know, so, um, you know, just build that cross up just a hair, you know, uh, some type of weld, hard plastic, heat, whatever, um, you know, and just build that up. Then you put it back, it, 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 and it just went down a hair, so that, that's the fix. The problem is it's behind the button, not the button. Uh, if your button's bad and it is smashed and, you, and you're not getting it clicked, well, then, yeah, uh, go get a new button that's obvious uh, but when you put your new button in and don't be surprised if it does the same thing if you don't build up that plastic cross uh, anyways um, hopefully that helps